audio check, click audio check. Okay, sync check. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, we're good, we good, we Gucci. Hi, what's up? <laughs> we'll be live in four minutes, man.
hello good morning good afternoon hope, hope everyone is doing well today this is it okay i don't like the look of your group but i have a lot more people than i usually do when i start so this is wild this is wacky but today it's going to be a normal stream hello guys welcome to the chat we got scott we got Issa. we got tony thank you to leave a little thank you for coming in and saying hi i still don't understand how you 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 don't drink or you don't have cereal with milk that is insane to me like milk is the only time or cereal is the only time i have milk okay let's go ahead and get started let's go ahead and get started guys we're gonna be doing mario kart online we're not doing any challenge today so hopefully we're gonna get some w's should we do regional or worldwide the regional look at that i got 5k points i can't go back oh okay i know yesterday at the very end of stream Ready to dig games, redeem Peach. We're gonna play be playing Peach at first today. If any of you little shits redeem Wario again, I will be upset. <laughs> Ooh, Uber. Okay, I get food delivery way too much, and I always get the same thing. I I always get like McDonald's. What else did I get? I Uber eats like Taco Bell a lot, like a, an embarrassingly amount of times i think and it's dumb because we have a mcdonald's like half a mile away from me but i'm like i don't want to walk there and like i can't drive yes burger king is mid let's actually get a poll and, okay <laughs> slash poll and jet uh, okay all our polls are literally just food related Oh, coconut ball, coconut ball, Abby. Okay, Burger King, good. Not it's icky or it's uh, amazing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, there's a poll up, guys. Go vote. I, I just want to, like, rag on Scott a little bit. Because Burger King is actual shit. Hello, welcome to the chat, Mom. I hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. And hello from TikTok. Thank you for coming into the stream today. <laughs> Burger King is amazing. Okay, vote in the poll. Let's see how many of you guys. We have two and two. Okay, it chose my course. It chose my course. Okay, I have a story time for Burger King that we will get to. Well, hi, welcome to Chat Nights. I hope you're doing well today. Wait, Burger King is better than McDonald's? No way. No way. Okay, you're actually lying, Naito. Yo, I thought you said disturbed. <laughs> Scott, not delusional. Hi, welcome to Charity. Hope you are doing well today. Burger King is trash. I've only had Burger King one time, and it was when I was eight years old. Grant, I live in Washington, but we were like visiting our grandparents in Hawaii, and I was eight. I have no recollection of the story, but my mom will tell the story anytime if you want to like try Burger King. And like in Hawaii, Burger King is not popping off because just in general, there's so many more better places you can go to locally, right? Oh, I forgot to run a prediction, Sag. Anyway. So, like, we got- we all got burgers, right? And then we all yak. We all threw up when we got them. Like, literally, everyone who got a burger threw up. So, ever since then, I have yet to try Burger King. Burger King is- no way it is better than McDonald's. You are actually delusional. The only thing that I, like, kind of want to try from Burger King is the Impossible Burger. Like, literally, the only thing that seems appetizing. Okay, yeah, I've seen, like, the promos for the chicken fries, and yes, I agree, they do look good. But actually, are they? Hi, welcome to Chat Some Bear. Hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. But I hope you are doing well. Wendy- Yes, Wendy's actually goaded. <laughs> Wendy's is the best. Literally. Okay. Bear, you've redeemed yourself. I know you're new to chat, but Wendy's, we're gonna be best friends now. Uh, okay, actually, Wendy's in like the past three years has like gotten like worse. Like it used to be amazing, but I feel like the meat tastes different. And literally, okay, literally every time I order, um, <laughs> Hello. um, anytime I get Wendy's like delivery or like even like just ordering through drive-through, literally every single time I get diarrhea. Guaranteed nowadays. So I don't know if it's like a local issue because we always like go to the same place because we're like one Wendy's in town. Unlike how there's like a McDonald's on every corner, right? 
Guys, I'm in 10th place. I, I'm, I'm too busy shit-talking Burger King right now. Four of you guys think that Burger King is better or good? What is wrong with y'all? <laughs> the praise Wendy's? Yes, we okay. What makes Wendy's good is their Frosties. Yes, I agree. Wendy's is consistently decent. Even though I shit myself, it is good. <laughs> okay, let's get predictions up and running, guys. We're gonna do predictions for... I don't know what lobbies are gonna look like, because I know the last time we played, like, I got top three, like, pretty consistent. We're gonna start with top six for right now. We're gonna do top six, gentle reminder. Prediction is for top six, okay? I'm saying this ten times so you guys don't get mad at me. <laughs> yeah, literally all fast food. <laughs> Three ninety nine. That's actually crazy. <clears throat> okay, we got one hundred nineteen in doubt. You think I won't get top six, even though I did get seventh last round? Yeah, Wendy's nuggets are mid. Like actually mid. Oh, you redeemed. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I saw it and then I forgot. I was I was too heated about fucking Burger King. I, next round, I promise. Next round. I mean, I meant to do that off screen. Yeah, I agree. Because what sucks about, like, chain places is that the workers make the restaurant, right? So if you always have, like, one, like, shitty worker, then you're always gonna have a bad time. That's why, if you're, like, working for a place, like, try and be- even if, like, the job is shit, like, try and, like, be the best worker you can. Because you don't want to ruin it for everyone else, you know? We're not gonna trick, we're gonna trick off- oh, I think you're gonna trick off the mushroom. Oh yeah. Has anyone- I think there was like a promo period where they had strawberry flavored Frosties? Amazing. And like, you know how you see like the Pinterest recipes for like, ooh, you can make this at home, but it's never as good as like the actual real deal. My mom, when she was a teenager, she used to work at Wendy's, so like she knows like all the ins and outs. Granted, she's old, so they might have changed a few things. <laughs> Go for the skip. I need a boost. I literally can't go for the skip if I don't have a boost, Tony. Anyway, so like they would have to like dump bags and bags of like expired frosty because like they can't really keep overnight. <laughs> oh yeah, like crossover restaurants would be pro would be pretty good. I think what would be a good one? Cause I know they have like you'll see like Taco Bell's and like Pizza Hut's together. I think it is right. But like crossover menu would be interesting. Oh, it's, okay, Tony, I try and go for the cut and I throw. I literally throw. Okay, I can catch up. I can catch up. God, of course! Of course it ran out when I went through the cut. Sorry, I didn't warm up today. I played one game of Unite, and I lost that game. So I'm honestly a little bit upset. Oh my god, we're in 7th. I was like, shit! Thank you for the follow, Barlow. I appreciate it. Feel free to chill, like whatever makes you happy. Oh my god! Sorry, I... I am very dis... At least I didn't get last. At least I didn't get less. Yes, everyone literally distract me. <laughs> I am sorry, believers. I threw. Wait, I gotta have the scoreboard on screen, right? Oh, I didn't erase these, Sag. Okay, we got a 7th and then an 11th. I'm erasing these from last time. Sorry. <clears throat> Oh my god, I have a gun. Uh, cheap, cheap. Easy. Okay. Now we have the leaderboard updated. <laughs> Distractions have worked. <laughs> yeah, honestly. Honestly. Uh, what's on my game wish list? Um. Can you do a prediction is up, guys? I am dying to play Kirby. But my sister said she will buy me Kirby for my birthday, which is next month. So I'm not going to be able to play it till next month. Because I don't like buying too many games because I feel like I'm neglecting a game if I don't play it, you know what I mean? But I definitely want to play Kirby. 
Or like, I don't mind to play like Mario Double Dash, but I don't know if that can be ported to the Switch. So like, I might have to get an emulator for that. What's my favorite character? Hmm. I think to play is. Uh, I'm sorry, Issa. I'm. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I'm literally scamming you right now. I I have such ADD brain right now, like, I cannot focus. I promise you, I promise you, I will do Bowser. Just hack your Wii. No, 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 no. We ain't doing that. It's my sister's Wii and I feel like she'll get mad at me. Oh, double dash? Maybe. I might have to, like, I'll have to make her a PowerPoint presentation, like, justifying buying it. Oh my god, we're in third! Oh my god. <laughs> oh yeah, I agree. Like, trying to finish the games you buy. I think. Because I usually will play games to completion in terms of, like, finishing the main story at least. Because, like, I feel bad if I don't play it all the way through. I mean, to me, games aren't necessarily, like, I think they're worth the price point. I know people, like, complain about, like, ooh, I don't want to buy a game that's $60. But if you think about it, how many hours of entertainment is that game going to give you, right? Like, it's gonna give you, like, at least, like, five to ten hours of inter entertainment, right? Guys, we are in second place. But, like, I don't mind paying 60 bucks for a game. Like, granted, it might take a while to save up for it, but I don't mind. Wait, why am I holding onto this red shell? <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> I, I really need to work on my XQC impression. I I honestly think I would be great at it. Yeah, I agree. If the game is worth it, go for it. That one lightning bolt messed me up. I don't think there's any way for me to come back now. Maybe. Literally no way. Literally no way. I I had it in my grasp. Okay, let's be honest. If I was playing Bowser, no way I would have won. Like no shot. I got tenth or eleventh, right? <laughs> Downers went again, poggers. <laughs> uh yeah, I think you redeemed Bowser, right? It's a big man Bowser, yeah. I thought you meant Dravos, okay. I had <laughs> I'm sorry, Barry. The the title is total clickbait. Like I I'm decent. I am decent at this game, but I am not amazing, right? <clears throat> okay, top six, new prediction is up, guys. I think my favorite character to play for the deluxe version is Gold Mario. Because I feel like it's a flex. Play Baby Junior, or play Baby Bowser. But is this a big man Bowser? I feel like they meant a big man Bowser, you know, not baby Bowser. 250 in doubt. Sag, any believers? <laughs> oh, you play with smart steering? Honey. Practice without smart steering. Because, <laughs> like, smart steering is basically playing with handy- er, <laughs> With a handicap- or no, a handicap is a deterrent. It's like basically playing with training wheels is what I meant to say. But, like, with smart steering? You're casual? I see, I see. Well, if you want to become pro like me, start playing without smart steering. Okay, we need to go faster since we have a heavy character. I- I still don't- maybe I need to change my bike build if I'm gonna be playing a heavy character. Give your in fourth, got a solid fourth place. A pro like me, I know, right, Kappa? <laughs> Imagine. I- I'm- I- I am trying- please get above six, you put doubt. Why- why do you- you want to lose your points, Mew? <laughs> Dude, I am in Sega right now. I still think the best strategy overall is to try and stay in the front as much as you can. Okay, double item box. 
We got 10 full coins. We do not need more coins right now. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I did not mean to yell that loud. <laughs> oh my god. My dad is probably like freaking out. He's like, what the fuck are you doing, Megan? Okay. I messed up. I messed up. <laughs> my thoughts on smart steering. Make it twit longer and smart steering. <laughs> yeah, it, it takes a while to like wean yourself off of smart steering, but definitely okay. Practice with computers, don't do online. Online is scary. No! Oh my god! Please, I, I'm literally so close to sixth place. Uh! Guys. Okay, I hit one person with fireball. And me. Can somebody please choose a different character? If you want me to win, get, please give me a different character. Like, actually. Okay, we got an eighth. We got an eighth. We got Mario Kart working. Let's go. Let's go. Imagine Rainy playing Mario Kart on stream. That'd be crazy. I, I would watch every single stream if you played Mario Kart Rini. Pink Yoshi! Thank you, Tony! Thank god. What character? Just anything not heavy. Literally anything not heavy. Or is Yoshi? There we go. Okay, this will be better, because this is like a medium weight character. Oops. Yeah, I agree, Barry. I totally agree. But like, you just gotta, you gotta practice. Yeah, totally, not a Totally. Like, once you disable smart steering, once you, like, actually know how to play... Makes the game so much better. <laughs> uh, so, Sunberry, if you're new to chat, at the bottom left corner of your chat box is the channel for Redemptions. <laughs> there should be one for choose my Mario Kart character. So that's what the other chatters are using right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna win this one. No, you're fine. Okay, I, I get to say another. I think Boo. It's technically a heavy character, right? <laughs> the saver points got it. Got it, Buzz. Oh, it says yeah because I believe for the Mario Kart character, it's timed out for a minute or two minutes after someone redeems it. That's why you guys don't like overlap each other. Because let's say there was no time up for it, and like five of you redeemed it at once, there would be no way for me to like. Or it would be difficult for me to like scroll up and see like what everyone's options were. Yeah, honestly, why is Ghost a heavy character? It doesn't fit with the lore. It does not seem canon. <laughs> yeah, that was better. That was a much better line right there. Oh! Oh my god, I thought it was gonna fall off! we go. Easy. Mario Lauren shambles, literally. Ah, oh, yeah, we got the guy with the boombox. Oh my god, holy shit, we're in first. Oh my god. Wait, no prediction? Did I really not make a prediction? Did I really not? Sag? I thought I did. Mods? Mod check? Okay, they're gonna throw it behind them. They're gonna play dirty. They're gonna wait till I get right behind him and drop it. See, look, 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 look. See? They missed me, though. Screw you, man. Oh, I should've waited. I literally should've held and waited. I, I got too excited. Dude, if we get first right here... Oh my god. Oh my god, please. No! Oh my god, we're right here! We're right here! Please! Can somebody 
somebody clip that, please? Please. I did get top six. I got second place, which is amazing. I held first for that second half, but second, that was amazing. Best race of the day, and we're only, what, four races in? <laughs> Sag. <laughs> Imagine putting doubt and then you lose all your points. Imagine. <laughs> okay, new prediction is up. <clears throat> Thank you. I appreciate it, Mew. We're gonna win. <clears throat> that was crazy, though. It sucks, because, like, the blue shell hit me right before I could have crossed. Like, I was literally right there. Literally. Anybody want to doubt? We got 700 and believe right now. Imagine I throw. <laughs> <clears throat> Somebody toss, like, 10 points in doubt. And if I throw, you get literally all 700 points. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> I feel like this lobby is pretty well matched, though. Like, no one is, like, insanely good. Or maybe I'm the insanely good player? Imagine. <laughs> okay. okay, we're gonna trick off of this one. Oh, this isn't 200cc. I think this is 150. No items? Rip. Oh, I almost did it! Because, like, the trick with that eel is to try and stay on, like, the tippy tip. And just keep boosting. Oh my god, no items! I think Yoshi's taunts are so cute. Like, did you see when he tricked up and then he just, like, jumped and, like, wiggled his feet? That was cute. Bowser? Okay. Back to Bowser, guys. <clears throat> okay, the mushroom saved me right there. I just think today is gonna be everyone fighting to change the character. That's probably what today is gonna be. Which is fine, I live for that. guy in first again. Us two fighting for it. Why does Issa hate me? I don't know. I, I swear. Okay, you know the more you watch a streamer and the more you like you get accustomed to them, you feel like you're closer to them and then you feel like you can start being mean. Like I feel like there's a timeline for that for when that happens, right? Oh my god, it's <laughs> I totally saw that. I totally saw it. Yes, I I okay maybe the more I play heavy character maybe I will get better so maybe you're right. Hi welcome to chat scrub lord <laughs> <laughs> if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Otherwise, feel free to chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. But thank you for coming into stream. Hi, Scootish. Welcome to chat. Hope we're doing well today. Oh my god! <laughs> Scootish literally distracted me with his partner badge and made me fall off and fall from third to fucking seventh. Hi, welcome to chat, Scootish. Hope you're doing well. Hello, welcome to chat. I'm Giorgio. Hope you're doing well today. Oh my god, please, give me a six. Give me a six. Ah, uh, look at that. Every day is a good day, baby. Hope you're doing well today, Georgie. If you, have, if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. <laughs> Not showmish. <laughs> okay, what did I get? I, I literally got sixth place. Believers won. Okay, literally no doubters. Imagine. Come on. How could nobody doubt? Based on my track record today, I got one second. Everything else is kind of trash. <laughs> okay. Go ahead and get our next... <laughs> Next prediction up. Um, I want to do Warriors Gold Mine. That's one of my definitely top few tracks. Okay, next prediction is up, guys. Wait, um, it's a redeemed Bowser, right? Screw you, Issa. Geo? Oh, okay, I love Geo. <laughs> Are we able to join in? Not today. I currently don't have my um, friend code public, but I might in the future. I think next month I will be doing a tournament for my birthday. It's still being planned. So that is when 
we will be able to play with viewers. But I'm still planning out my birthday stream. Also, um, since you have more people in chat, exclamation you laugh you lose. If you are a follower, um, I am doing a viewer submitted you laugh you lose for my birthday stream next month. So if you have time, you have about three weeks to submit three YouTube videos at that Google form below in the chat box. So we got one submission last night. <laughs> oh, hi, welcome to chat Rex. Hope you're doing well today. That was cute. Jag Dragon in the juice box. Okay, I was planning, because, like, I have applesauce on my desk, because, like, I had a small breakfast. And I was planning on, like, eating that between rounds, but I don't think I have time. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. I got a lot more sleep last night. Still feeling refreshed. Feeling great. And by that, I mean I got, like, six hours instead of four hours of sleep. Yeah, I saw it was you. I can't look at the videos, so I'm gonna have um, my mod review them. So hopefully they're good. Ho hopefully they are good vids. <laughs> Do I play any Pokemon games? Not at the moment. I used to play Unite on stream, but then I got Master Rank and then I got bored. So, I might play a Pokemon game in the future. Um, exclamation schedule to see what my, the current games I play on stream are. But right now, my, I guess, variety game is SM3D World. And then once I'm able to play Kirby, Kirby's gonna be the next game. So I think after Kirby, I might consider doing like a Pokemon game, maybe. But like the issue of playing Pokemon on stream is like it's such like a dedicated community that I feel like I'm not. I like Pokemon. Like I grew up watching the show, but I'm not like into into Pokemon. So I feel like people will like give me shit if I don't know like the different like type advantages or whatever. Uh, did I watch K drama last night? I didn't last night. I was tempted. But I was like, you know, I'm gonna be good. I'm going to go to sleep early, and then I did. <laughs> oh my god, someone, some little fucker put a banana in the mystery box. If it was one of you guys, we're not friends anymore. <laughs> you got a puppy? Oh my god, Rex. Oh my god. That's nice. I'm, I'm happy for you. I wish I could get a pet right now. I would die of happiness. Ooh, I've been wanting a bunny so bad. When I was little, we used to have a little bunny. Because we got it when it was a baby bunny. Is there, like, a name for a baby bunny? Is that a thing? Oh my god! Triple red shell! Anyway, so, like, we had him for eight years. Like, he died old. Feels bad, man. But I've been wanting a pet rabbit again. Cause like, they're usually pretty chill. They usually will just let you, like, pet them all day. But I, I also- I want a cat. I feel like a dog is a bit too high energy for me, but like, a cat? Ooh. If I move out, first thing I'm getting is literally a cat. A hare? I thought a hare was like a wild rabbit. No! Oh my fucking god. I thought I was gonna fall off right at the end there. Holy shit. Bunlet? <laughs> I don't think that's it. I don't think that's it. Let's actually Google this right now. Actually, let's not. I feel like- I, okay, let's end our prediction. Okay, top six? Yes, I got- I literally- wait. I got third, right? Yeah, I didn't get second. I got third. New prediction is up, guys. We had a pretty decent split last time. Some of you doubters got screwed. <laughs> Hi Q, welcome to chat. Hope you're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me, even though we call you Q anyway. <laughs> I'll go to pro racing. I don't know, it's going pretty good. I'm doing pretty decent. I got a second and a third today, which is actually pretty good for like the first 30 minutes of stream. So, doing good. They're called kittens? No way. No way. No way. No way. Are they actually... Bye. Thank you for coming to the stream today, Mew. Hope your day goes well. Huh, yeah, I thought hares were like wild rabbits. So Somebody look this up, please. I don't have time for this. Somebody look this up. <laughs> Ooh, Animal Crossing. Like, yes, they are. Are they really? Some Somebody fact check Rex. I don't trust him. <clears throat> you looked it up. Will somebody else look it up? Wow. 
Oh my god, no items! I should have gone the center path. <laughs> no one- <I> literally. <laughs> no one trusts dragons. <laughs> they're called kittens? Okay, Scott is saying they're called kittens. So if we got two people saying it's kittens, it's probably it. Oh my god, Connor eats pants? What the fuck? Sorry, the guy in front of me is called Connor. See, look! Because I'm playing a heavy-ass character, two people cut me off. Because I'm so fucking slow. Somebody please, somebody please change my character. Please. You feel insulted? Well, I'm sorry, Rex. Now that we have another person vouching for you, I guess we have to trust you more, right? All right. Oh my god, it's gonna pull you back! Oh, thank god. Thank god Lakitu didn't pick me up. Do you trust Dragon? <laughs> well, I trust Q, therefore I trust Dragon now. <laughs> you have redeemed yourself, Rex. You mess up again, you're done. You're done. Wario? Thank you for redeeming Choose My Character, Asa. Wario is fine. Wario is fine. Needs to be shorter. I think. I don't know what the cooldown is. I might change it after stream then. We'll see. We'll see. Uh. <laughs> yeah, just get good, guys. That's literally what I do. In Rainy's chat, she has a channel for redemption to like catch a Pokemon that shows up on screen. And I literally have my finger on the trigger, ready to redeem it. Like, I'm annoying too. <laughs> what the fuck is it from changing? I don't think I can. Wait, if you're. Okay. If you're timed out, you can't type stuff in chat, right? Wait, this is lap three! I did not realize this was lap three! Oh, I got a seventh! Man. I was close. I was pretty darn close. <clears throat> uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. If you're, like, timed out or banned, you can't type in chat. But can you still redeem channel point redemptions? Can you still earn channel points if you're banned? Imagine you're a hate watcher and you have, like, a million channel points. That'd be crazy. <laughs> Should run a pull. <laughs> to see if we... I don't think we can... I'll have to look into that. Because if someone gets- because like the only way- because I can't block a specific user from using a channel for redemption, I don't think. Or maybe I just make it an insane amount of channel points. New prediction is up, guys. Oh my god! Thank you for the gifted sub, Scootish. I appreciate it. You're still at the top of our leaderboard. And look, we hit our sub goal. Holy shit! Um, I give chat a hug after this round. I don't want to do it now. I feel like I'm going to throw. But thank you for the gift of sub scootish. I appreciate it, man. <laughs> yeah, we should all just beat up Issa. Maybe that'll stop him. <laughs> I mean, Issa does have, like, 7k points. So maybe... I think... Maybe Rainy or Cuter Lee has the second most points. I think Cuter Lee has like 20k. <laughs> Imagine banning Issa. Imagine. <laughs> um, I feel like if I made it 1k points, I feel like Issa would be less likely to troll. Because then it's only 14% of their channel points when compared to like 10% or like 5%, right? Maybe, maybe that's what I gotta do. <laughs> no, Issa will like troll me. They, they drop like 1... 1k points just to mess with us last night, remember? Or not last night, yesterday. <laughs> so, like, if it's for a good bit, they will follow through. I mean, that's how I am, too, so, like, I totally understand. <laughs> I'm actually doing fairly decent with Wario, even though they're probably, like, the same weight as Bowser. Maybe if I just start concentrating, I start winning. Yeah, that's not how you're supposed to do it. Yeah. <laughs> 
already spent 2k. Is it worth it? Is it worth it, Issa? Is it good for the bit? Is it worth? <laughs> if there was a way... Okay, what's cool is that me as the broadcaster, I have literally infinite amount of points. So if I wanted to... I mean, okay, if we look at the Channel for Redemptions, the most expensive one is I gift you a tier 3 sub for, like, what, 100 million channel points? <laughs> but, like, I can't gift- oh, wait, I can- I can gift myself subs. Wait, I just realized I was in first for, like, 10 seconds. You guys, maybe Wario was actually good luck? I know, they- they- they changed Wario's body, and I don't stand anymore. <laughs> that was rude. Oh fuck, I messed up the drift. I literally messed up the drift. Okay, we're good, we're good. We got fifth, we're good. I was close. We got it. Now you can't back it up on us anymore. <laughs> I know, it feels bad, man. <laughs> okay, so... We got a fifth place. Also, since Scootish helped hit our sub goal, you know what it is? It's time to give Chad a hug. Are you guys ready? Are you guys gonna stand up and get ready? Good hug. There we go. You guys like that? I like that. <laughs> Okay. Back to game. <laughs> Dude, I am very much like a hugger. Like, I'm- I used to be the kind of friend who didn't like touching anyone. But now I'm like, I'm all for hugs. I love it, man. Go ahead and start a new sub goal, guys. Okay, new sub goal is up. Any Oilers? Any Oilers? <laughs> okay, let's get back to it. <clears throat> oh my god. I'm so glad that Coconut Mall was one of the first few tracks in the DLC launch. Because this was honestly the only track that I wanted. <laughs> like, after seeing it in the preview, it's so much hype. I forgot to trick there. Oops. What hit me? Sorry, I, I don't understand what hit me because I literally had a triple banana. Something like snug its way in there. Okay, they're gonna drop the bomb. They're gonna drop the bomb. Oh, they threw it ahead? Interesting. Imagine I actually go pro in Mario Kart. That'd be crazy. There is, like, pro leagues for Mario Kart, though. Like, actually. And if you watch it on YouTube, the videos are insane. Like a pro match is literally just this. <laughs> They're switching between POV or looking behind and then front. Because, like, pro matches is solely focused on game use. Hi, welcome to Chat Rose. Hope you're doing well today. Okay, that was actually a horrible line. Okay, I still need to work on this line right here. I can never make the turn tight enough. Yeah, that one was fairly decent, though. You can catch up. Okay, this is a horrible item. But we do have full protection. Oh my god! We got a fourth, we're good, we got a fourth. <clears throat> Hi, 
I know it's not nice to throw items behind you, but I think it's fair to throw them behind you when, as you're crossing the finish line. I think that is fair. Like, that's not as despicable. You know what I mean? Okay, new prediction is up, guys. I'm gonna start on my applesauce. I have... It is mango flavored applesauce. Because my mom, she works for the school, right? So, so she's there for breakfast and lunchtime. And I don't know if this is like national standard, but here in Washington State, they're required to give them all like required parts of the meal. So even if they aren't going to eat the fruits or aren't going to eat the veggies, they still have to take it. So my mom, she'll take home like five of these every day. She'll bring home like six chocolate milks, four bananas, like literally every day. Because otherwise, the food will get thrown away, right? And it sucks. I understand it's, it's, it makes sense to require to like hand out the food. But it just feels so wasteful. I'm playing to win right now. I'm literally playing to win. <laughs> Come on. Okay, I didn't fall too far behind because I think it was in six when I fell off, yeah? Yeah, we, we need Kirby to step in and save us all, man. <laughs> I also feel bad because a lot of, like, a few of my favorite streamers, I think Scootish started playing Kirby. And then Hassan started playing Kirby yesterday, so like, now I can't watch their streams because I'm trying my hardest not to avoid spoilers, or trying my hardest to avoid spoilers. And like, I just want to watch my streamer stream and then they play a game that I cannot watch right now. Feels bad, man. I wish they would stop playing the game just so I could watch the stream again. Yeah, I like this map a lot too, honestly. It's just not fun with online. Like, I'm pretty decent at this line of computers, but online, no shot. <laughs> Maybe it's actually better that we're playing a heavy character for this map. Did Wario say, I hate this? If so, I agree. I hate this game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I, I love Mario Kart so much. It's just frustrating. I'm sorry, believers. Doubters got a lot of points that round, Sag. I had a six. I literally had it. it feels bad, man. You lost. I'm sorry, Rose. I'm actually doing- I'm doing okay today. Looking at the leaderboard, I could be doing better, but I'm doing okay today. I usually do a lot worse. Also, I think with the DLC being launched, there's like just an influx of people playing. So there's a lot of lower people playing. That's why lobbies are kind of trash right now. My review on this applesauce? Don't put other fruit with applesauce. It doesn't taste nearly as good. Like, I would not eat it. But then I feel bad. Because if I don't eat it, a kid's gonna throw it away. Does this one have sugar in it? Oh, it's mango peach flavored. That's- it like- you know how canned peaches have like a weird like sweet aftertaste? That's what I'm tasting right now. It's weird. Chicken salad. 
I have never had a salad in my life, if you can't tell. <laughs> Sorry, don't call me fat. You'll get banned. Anyway. <laughs> I just can't- I literally can't down vegetables. It's- I think it's a mental thing. I can't do it. Like, I will try my best. It's also a texture thing. It doesn't go down easy. Panera bread so much, but it's also super expensive. The Panera soups? God tier. Actually amazing. Have y'all tried their mac and cheese grilled cheese? It is so good. Probably super unhealthy, but it is so good. Oh, I used to be like that too. Um, when I was little. Oh my god. Because my parents were like really controlling with how we eat food. Because like, um, I didn't start gaining weight till I was in fourth grade. So like when puberty hit, right? So like my parents would like try to monitor our portion sizes, which makes sense. Makes sense, right? But like I would sneak like snacks at night. I stopped doing this when I was like 14. But I would sneak like snacks and treats at nighttime. And I would literally sneak frosting out of the frosting tub and have that at like 5 p.m. But like, as of recent, I'm usually able to like, cause I- I tried- there was a period where I tried intermediate fasting, but then, what happened when I did do that, like, I overeat, like, because I limited myself to two meals in that eight hour window, and for those two meals, it was like, basic- almost a double portion, which is not good. Like, right now I'm trying- okay, these bats are not helping. Right now I'm trying to do like three meals a day, but like smaller portion size, and I feel like that's working better for me. Like, my goal is not to lose weight right now. My goal is to, like, just not be 10 pounds heavier than I am now. Right? Okay, the guy's gonna throw the red shell. He's gonna hit me. Ooh, come on, come on. We're so close to sixth place. Come on! Oh, we got a fifth. We got a fifth. <laughs> trying to, you know, the, yeah, it's good. That's good that you're, like, taking those steps, Rose. For sure. What did I get? I got fifth. I got fifth. Let's go. Believers win. Yeah, because, like, I have a do- oh. Okay, sorry. My thing refreshed and I got scared. I thought we effed. Anyway. Um, I have a doctor's appointment next month. And I'm like- Because it, it's, like, one of those annual exams where they, like, take your vitals, like, check your weight and stuff. So, like, I'm scared. Because the scale we have at home, it's off by 7 pounds. So, for example, if it says I weigh 150, which I don't, nowhere near. Um, like, I actually weigh 157. So, like, the scale is 7 pounds off. 165, that's good. Have you? I think as long as you're, like, healthy. You know? Cause like it's easy to psych yourself out about your weight and like body image, but I think ultimately, as long as you are happy, you are healthy, and like able to function without too much stress or like physical strain, then you're fine. But it's it's okay. It's also fine to like want to, I guess, be thinner or like lose weight, but do it for the right reasons. You know, don't do it because your partner or your love interest wants you to lose weight. Like, that's not healthy, right? Do it because you want to be healthy. Dude, I haven't gotten any items so far. <laughs> oh my god, we're 10! I think we have time to do maybe three more rounds of Mario Kart, and then we're gonna go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. Oh yeah, I agree. Like if it's for like health reasons, like except for cholesterol, definitely. That that's fine. You know, it's good. Oh dude, I am so scared. When I have to go to the doctor, they're gonna tell me all oh, this shit that's wrong with me. 
Because <laughs> I haven't gone to the doctor in a long ass time. So there's probably gonna be like a long list of things that I need to work on. is broken really is it not letting you redeem I'll, I'll check that in a second Scott come on yeah we can catch up we only got nice place I just have to go up three places this is totally doable okay I feel like my lines are decent. Like, my lines are good. But it's just freaking items that fuck me over. It even started nothing. Nothing. Oh, well, character button is not broken. <laughs> if, if Rose can redeem it. Sedge. Maybe I refresh your tab, Scott, or Scott, if it's not working. Wait, I got... I got 8th, I got 8th. Just Sweet Canyon, I love this track so much. Finally, a good character. A light character. Or, I guess medium-sized character. Nothing too crazy. There we go. <clears throat> Top 6th? No shot. Sag. Yeah, I like playing Gold Mario, or... Pink, Rose Gold Peach, I think it's called. Those are my go-tos, usually. Because I just think they're a flex. <laughs> like, on the clips that I'm playing Gold Mario on, everyone's like, how do you get that character? And how do you get Gold Mario? Is you have to get gold trophies in all 200 CCs. Or 200 CC threes. Oh, I do the wrong command. Prediction is up, guys. Also, an ad is coming. <laughs> Now 50 believe and 10 in doubt. Uh, I'm not I'm not good at this track, I'ma be honest. I'm gonna be real, I'm dog shit at this course. Yeah, I definitely first started playing Mario when it came out, and then I stopped playing. Oh, was this 200? No, this is 150. I thought this was 200 and I got excited. <laughs> But, cause like, I started playing it again for stream. A few months ago. Hi, Emmy, welcome to chat. Hope you're doing well today. Anyway, so I started playing it again on stream. And I fell in love with the game. I think a big game changer for me, like, starting to enjoy the game, was disabling smart steering. <laughs> cause playing this game on smart steering is not fun. Ooh, that cut was pretty good. Still in ninth though. Can you imagine? Okay, I'm not gonna go for a skip here, because it's not worth missing an item box. But there is an item box on that ramp. Look, I literally got no items to. <laughs> not worth, I should have gone for it. Okay, we got a purple, that was beautiful. A lovely line right there. And what's funny, is that when we first bought this game, my sister was like, pretty good at it. But now, when I play with her, like, I keep, I've been playing with her just about every day this past week. And like, I've been like, absolutely destroying her, and she gets so mad when I beat her. Oh my god! Thank you for the resub, Emmy. I appreciate it. You're gonna get your neighbor net in the stream. Pretty pogos, pretty cool. Okay, that line was not cool, but thank you. I appreciate it, Emmy. Okay, we're in a solid ninth place. Okay. I ignore that. Ignore that. That was embarrassing. <laughs> we have a solid 12th place. We can catch up. We just have to move up 6 places for Believers to win. <laughs> 5 points. Yeah, actually. Please! No! <laughs> Guys, I, I went... I went 
for the skip, and then it disappeared. I know I don't like giving up, but I honestly feel like giving up right now. It's literally not worth. They just crossed the finish line. <sighs> well, well, we'll get them next time. We'll get them next time. See, doubters just dropped the minimum of 10 points, and they're up 50. And they're up 50. Mm -mm. See, what I need to do now, to make up for that, I need to literally get first. That is what I need to do. I need to pull a first right here. We're gonna do two more games. Good job! <laughs> Thank you, Emmy. I appreciate the compliment. I appreciate the encouragement. New prediction is up, guys. Thank you for the host, Issa. I appreciate it. If you ha talking about hosts, um, if you are on desktop, you can click the host button. That way, when people view your channel and I'm live, they'll see me on your channel. So, like, if you enjoy my content and you think your friends or followers on your channel will like the content, you can put me on your auto host or host me. That'd be pretty pago. Yes! Thank you for redeeming Gold Mario. That's my favorite character to play. Thank you, Scott. Scott is listening. Scott is, like, actually paying attention. I see why you got 12. Yeah, I am good at, like, computers. But online, I'm so trash. And as of recent, since, since the DLC has come out, online lobbies are not fun. But yeah. We're gonna we're gonna get it first here. We're gonna we're gonna do it. Okay, double item box, easy. Oh, we got two people. Let's go. I know, like actually. Um, a reason why I don't want to share my friend code is I'm so scared it's gonna get leaked, and then because like you know how you, when you watch like bigger streamers play Mario Kart and literally the whole time they're getting stream sniped. Like, not saying that I'm gonna be famous, like, it's gonna be a long-ass time before that happens, if even. But I'm scared of, like, my friend code getting leaked, so, um, that's why it's not public. Like, I don't want, like, stream snipers to ruin the game, you know what I mean? Oh, I missed, I missed. Oh my god, I'm gonna clip him! We dodged, we dodged. I hit the mud. No! Oh. Hey, we're still in fourth. We're doing good. We got a fourth. I'm also just used to playing 200 CC. So, like, it, it takes me a while to get adjusted to, like, 100 or 150 again. Like, if y'all watch me play 200 CC comms, I am goaded. I am god tier. Okay, that was awkward. Ignore that. <laughs> Hey, homie, why are you throwing fire behind you? Actually, don't. I just need to get the double item box here, then we're set. Okay, um... I do have a third, though. Okay, we got a fifth. Did you guys see that? They threw the banana in front of me, and it literally landed right in front of me. But I dodged that shit. Okay. <laughs> Imagine putting doubt... And I got fifth, imagine. Okay, so this will be our last Mario Kart game of the day. Then we're gonna go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. Okay, also, Scott redeemed Gold Mario, my favorite character to play. Cool, ending on a high note. I swear, like, Issa is just, like, hiding in the shadows, waiting for, like, me to feel good, and then just redeem Wario again. But, haha, <laughs> actually, this is the last race of the day. <laughs> last prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. Hi, welcome to chat, Stick Knockwell. Hope we're doing well today. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. 
Otherwise, feel free to chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. But yeah, it's the last race of the day, baby! And it, of course, it's the Zand level. Oh, you see me hover? Pago, imagine. I think you're my first person to come in and chat from hover. But that's cool, that's cool, man. Because, like, I swear, like, all my followers are from TikTok. Insane. But hello from hover. I know, cheese time. I, I hate this level so much. But we're playing my favorite character. This feels a bit faster. Is this 200? It's not 200, but it feels a bit faster. Ah, uh, thank you, Emmy. It's, it's, it's piece in 17, I think. I don't think there's an underscore. I don't have a command for my hover. Your stream element, Sedge. Yeah, I love the gold Mario skin. It feels like such a flex, you know? Because the way to get it is to get all uncle uh, trophies in 200cc. So not a lot of people have it. Okay, my lines have been fairly decent this round and I'm only in 6th place. <laughs> Mods, come on. Come on. Okay, you wanna start? Go for the cut here. Easy. I know. I wish, like, it'd be cool if, like, the boomerang auto targeted people like a red shell would. That would be a good mechanic. But then it'd basically be, like, the red shell, so I kinda understand why it doesn't auto target. Like, okay, looking into it, that makes sense. What did they hit me with? Literally nothing. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. We're okay, we're fine. No need to get mad. We got a solid seven. Oh, look, look, wait. If we look at the map, look how many gold Marios are in this race. There's two other golds and then a silver. How did I think of peace in for a username? So, story time. Story time. When I was a little kid, so like 13 or 14, I was at the public library going to nick.com. And there was like a chat room and you had to make a username. And I was like, I want to make it peace out. Like, you know, haha, peace out. Um, but then that was taken. So I was thinking. I was perplexed. And then I was like, wait. What is the opposite of out in? So that is how peace in was born. I think it's cute. I've been using that username ever since. Story time over. <laughs> okay, go for the gut! <laughs> Come on, dude! <laughs> okay, that's an eighth. That's an eighth. An eighth. Sag. I'm sorry, believers. Yeah, GG, GG. Top six, no shot. No way. Man, I was doing so good. <sighs> okay, we're gonna go ahead. Oop, wrong button. We're gonna go ahead and switch gears to Animal Crossing. So anybody new to chat, the way like the Animal Crossing segment works is like it's basically we just mess around on the island and then we chill and we talk. So like it's kind of like just chatting mostly. So if you guys have questions. Or want to talk about stuff. I have some pretty good food takes. As you talked about earlier, Burger King is shit. Fight me on that. So, we're gonna go ahead and switch gears. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, have fun, chat amongst yourselves, you know. <clears throat> Great name origin story. Thank you. I think it's cute. I think it's cute. Because, like, it's not, like, weird, right? And it's also, like, it doesn't make sense. I like stuff. It doesn't make sense, by the way. I also kind of like how it's a neutral name. Like, I didn't want to put anything too feminine or too masculine in the name. The only thing I do not like about it is that <laughs> a few of my streamer friends um, calling out Cutie Lee and Rainy Dane's Go follow their Twitch, but actually, they call me P, like P E A. So, like P, like piss, and it's weird. It's weird, but you know it's fine. It's fine. Okay, I okay. Story time. Story time. I went into like a randos guy's chat who was playing Mario Kart. This was ages ago. <laughs> P. I know. Stop, Amy. Stop. Actually, stop. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. Um. So I went into their chat. And, like, I chatted for a little bit, but, um, I'm gonna be honest. Hot take. 
Hot take. There is a reason why some people stay at one viewer. It took me a while to like have one viewer. I don't look at viewer count throughout stream typically. Um, but there is a reason why people stay small, you know? Anyways, the guy was boring. He was kind of like dickish, right? I don't like that personality. I don't like it. So like I left the chat after a little while. And I, okay, when I'm in chat, if I'm in your chat and I say bye, I usually stay for like another two minutes. Because I have this anxiety in my head to think that everyone talks shit once I leave the room or like I leave a call, right? That's just how like my anxiety brain works. Um, so like I left the chat. I said, oh bye, I'm heading out. And then as I was leaving, he like looked at my username snicker. He's like, oh, sounds like pissing. He's like, ha, ah, that's funny. And I was like, oh, cool, thanks, man. Uh, call me piss. Let's go. I didn't go back in his chat after that. I was like, fuck that. Okay. Let, let's think of a good title. Yeah, it that's like anxiety sucks. Peace in. See, you you understood it. You got it, Knockwell. You understood it, right? It's pretty straightforward. Okay, let's think of a good title. Let's think of a good title. Should we call it Burger King is Trash? Uh, <laughs> let, let, let's let's annoy Scott a little bit. Burger King is trash. Oh no 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 no. All fast food is mid. Uh, wait, all fast food. I cannot spell. All fast food is mid, and then your way is terrible. <laughs> Animal Crossing is like really sad. <laughs> you never run in an Animal Crossing stream? I, Cause like, um. On Wednesdays, we usually do online and then Animal Crossing. Also, Gentle Reminder, if you are new to chat, I'm doing a special You Laugh, You Lose stream on my birthday next month. So feel free and fill out that Google form with three of your favorite funny haha -ha YouTube videos. There's more links or more rules in that Google form. You do have a month to figure out three banger clips. So yeah, feel free if you have time, check out and fill out that form. Like piecing? Yeah, exactly. I think it's pretty straightforward. I don't know. I think it's cute. I've had people ask me if I want to change my username. Okay, you know how you see people who their username is literally their first and last name? I think that is stupid. I think that is brain dead to do. Because imagine, like, branding your own name. It, it doesn't make sense. It seems like uncreative to an extent, right? I'm team that is cute. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Or man, I forgot to ask. Real name is Nick Stockwell. Ooh. Oh, Knockwell? Okay, that's actually cute. It's cute. That is cute. Okay, we're gonna play the game. <laughs> or S, so there's no in-between. I think this is cute. I think it's cute. <laughs> Literally doxing yourself for free. Like, actually. I don't hide my name. Because in my head... Okay, I'm not gonna leak some things. But also... I think name is pretty straightforward. Like, that's not too crazy. Like, people are gonna want to find out your real name anyway, so... Okay, let's, let's, get, let's get started. <laughs> Hello there, everyone. Right now in Tibbaland, it is 12, 13 p.m. on Wednesday, March 30th, 2022. Oh, by the way, if you want to regger some new wallpaper to spruce up your place, the hair is visiting. She sells lots of unique designs you won't find anywhere else. I can't wait to find out what she brought today. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. They would call you Stick? <laughs> it, that, that is a weird nickname, I'm gonna be honest. That is a little weird. <clears throat> okay, we're good. I don't think I had any nicknames when I was younger. Oh no, my dad would call me Megachu. Like Pikachu. But Megan. Like Megachu. I think that's the only, like, real nickname I had. Okay. I think- let's look at our map. Oh, we have all our houses filled! Okay. So now that we have everyone moved in, I think the focus is going to be to actually decorate the island. Yeah, I agree. Like, I'm in- okay, I have a mixed opinion about people reading out dialogue. Because, like you said, like, some people, one, can't read as fast, 
And also, some people like to lurk or like listen to the stream and like sit down and watch. So I appreciate when people read out the chat boxes most of the time. I just don't like when it's like dialogue that they see every time. But let's talk to this girl. <laughs> oh, Gwen. I don't think we've talked to Gwen yet. <laughs> oh, aren't you Megan? I've heard so much about you. I swear you're the talk of the island. I must apologize for taking so long to introduce myself. A terrible faux pas on my part, or faux pas. Well, I'm Gwen. So pleasure to finally meet you. I simply can't wait to get to know you better. Oh, that was cute. That was cute. You raw dog in everything. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's cute. Oh no, imagine having double nicks. <laughs> okay, that kind of makes sense. Oh, scared the bugs away. Kind of makes sense. Okay, we only got one new flower. That sucks, but you know, better than nothing. I know I say that I'm gonna play off stream, but then I never do. So I think that is my fault. Called us double trouble. Like thing one, thing two. <laughs> That's so cute. I think at one point in school, there was like three other Megans in the classroom. And there was also a Megan S in the classroom. So it was just awkward for everyone. Do predictions for Animal Crossing. Um, what? Okay, let, let, let's think about this, guys. What predictions could we really do for Animal Crossing? Oh, okay, maybe, maybe. The only prediction I can really think of is for if we have like a campsite or really visiting a deserted island, would be are we gonna get a good villager or not? That's I think that's the only prediction I can think of. But then it's kind of subjective, right? Because. I'm not picky with my villagers. Literally, all I, all I want is Aurora. That's literally the only villager I need on the island. But I, I can't really think of any other prediction. Okay, we got our flowers watered. Oh, like who's visiting the island? I think because like predictions typically have two options, right? Mm. That one we'd have to workshop maybe. Oh, the balloon. I don't have a slingshot yet. Yeah, I don't have a slingshot. Let's go buy a slingshot. I keep on forgetting to buy a slingshot. That is totally my fault. Oh yeah, the last time we were here, we played last week. We had just upgraded our storage. I just walk through the door. It's not that hard. <laughs> Let's go buy- or not a boomerang. Slingshot. Did I say boomerang earlier? No, because we were talking about the boomerang in Mario Kart. Oh, finding wasp? Maybe, maybe. I think, I think it's so funny how, like, everyone in chat is, like, itching for a prediction, like, itching to gamble. I feel like I've ruined you guys. Like, genuinely. Because I know my favorite stream to watch is when they run predictions. Like, that's why I love watching Mario Kart stream so much. Oh, the balloon's gone, isn't it? Oops. Okay, I kind of want to visit everyone. 
Or at least talk to all the neighbors. Oh no, oh no. Hey, got a second? There's something that's been on my mind. I'm on the fence about whether I should whether I should leave this island. I've just been in a slump lately. No matter what kind of weight training I do, I don't get the soreness I want. Maybe working out in a new place would change my mood and give me some of that muscle soreness back. Okay. Let's run a poll. Let's run a poll, guys. <laughs> Let's run a poll. Are we going to keep Antonio? Because I'm on the fence. Like, Antonio's cool. Make him stay or let him go. You guys got one minute to vote. Hey, Tony! <laughs> okay, poll is up, guys. Do we keep Antonio or let Antonio go? Oh my god, is that a new emote, Rainy? Rainy, that is such a good emote. Like, no joke. That is amazing. Oh, we got three... We got three to make Antonio stay. We have one to let him go. My personal philo philosophy... Send him away! <laughs> My personal philosophy is if someone wants to leave or is thinking about leaving, I will let them go. I will let them go. Unless it's Aurora, then she's fucking stay. Otherwise, I will let them go. Kick him to the curb! <laughs> okay, it's tied, it's tied. It's tied. We let him go or make him stay. Yeah, thank you, Rady. I'm glad. I'm glad you're learning. Come on, we got like five seconds. Are oh, you little shits? Okay, Let, let's do a coin flip. Let's do a coin flip. <laughs> um, which tab? Okay, let's do a coin flip. Make it fair. Okay, I'm pulling up a coin flip right now. We're switching to YouTube cam. Ignore the- if uh, you laugh. Okay, we're doing coin flip. Ignore that ad. I'm not being paid. Ignore the ad. Okay, we're ready? Okay, heads, we let him go. No, heads, he stays. Tails, we let him go, okay? We're ready? Tails, we let him go. We got- we got heads. Okay, I, I guess... A Antonio is here to stay. Antonio is here to stay. Don't go, Antonio! Don't leave us! Huh? You really want me to stick around? You're right! I busted my tail here. I've drenched this hollowed ground with my sweat. Alright, you've opened my eyes. I'm staying right here. It was a 50-50 chance, you know. I, I guess fate wanted Antonio to stay. Honestly, screw you guys for making it a tie. <laughs> but we got Plucky. Yo! How are you? Haven't caught up in a while. Nobody's seen you here in, like, weeks. What were you doing? Yeah, I play once a week, man. Sorry. Sorry, dude. To... Don't tell me you were just spaced out from the TV all this time, because I totally would have joined you. Literally, me watching Twitch all day. <laughs> like, actually, it, it's a problem, guys. Because I like having stuff on in the background for, um, background noise. Because, like, I like just hearing people talking. Like, I have a Twitch stream, like, on in the background all day. So I, I used to play the mobile game, like, I was into it. But then, I think I played it for, like, three months leading up to the release of New Horizons. Because I was, like, getting ready for New Horizons to come out. And then, once New Horizons did come out... I literally stopped playing the mobile game and I haven't opened it since. Ooh, papers please. I've seen um walkthroughs of it. I remember if anybody watches like YouTube stuff, like I was like super into like Markiplier and Jack Septiguy. And definitely Papers Please was one of my favorite like Jack Septiguy series to watch. Oh! I missed it on the last one. Sign up like peace out. <laughs> I've thought about it, but I, I feel like that's cringe. I feel like that's like a little bit cringe. I don't know. I think streaming is just cringe, so maybe it's fitting. Maybe I should start doing that. Ooh, let's let's eavesdrop. 
Simon. Guess what, Gwen? The other day, I was outside, and... I was running and the ground tripped me and it hit my face. And it tore up my shirt, too. Bro, I hate when that happens. Urgh, I was so mad at the ground. There, there. I'm known as the Queen of Couture, after all. I'll design a new garment, and you can help. Really? <laughs> Yay, I'm really glad I told you. Hey, hang on. Who calls you the Queen of Cutlery? I've never heard that, Gwen. I've been thinking this for a while. But you are simply churlish at times. <laughs> Eagle much? I love churros. You're calling me a churry as well. <laughs> what an honor. Hold on now. I wasn't... Whatever. As my assistant, you've earned that title. I, I love that monkey guy. He's so cute. He's kind of like Flick, just totally oblivious to everything. No, that's not cringe. It's a brand. No, it's cringe. Like, you know, like the cliche, like, YouTube sign off? Who was it? Like, you know, PewDiePie's Bro Fist, and then, like, the thing where, like, they, like, put their hand up, their hand up to the camera, and that's their transition. But I also feel like that's very TikTok as well. Like, the transition stuff. Maybe, maybe. If we, if we can get a petition signed with, um, a million signatures, I will start doing peace out at the end of stream. Maybe we can do it? Have I ever played Paper Mario? I wanted to get Paper Mario. Uh, I think that is definitely a game I want to play. Or like the new Origami one that came out last year, yeah? It's another one I want to play. The reason why I didn't buy it when it came out was... Like, it was getting mixed reviews at the time. And I was like, I don't want to drop money if it's not that good. But I'll, I'll play it at some point. I definitely want to play like every single Mario game. At some point. That is what I want to do. Sub or dub? Um, sub, obviously. Oh my god, okay. If anybody has watched Hayaku, the dub for Hayaku, dog shit. Literally the worst. I can't do it. <laughs> Only good dubs is, like, the older anime. So, like, stuff that came out in 2000s, where, like, um, watching, like, subs in American broadcasting wasn't as, I guess, accessible, like, how there's, like, st a streaming software for, like, most anime now. Otherwise, um, sub all the way. <coughs> Lopez. Oh, it really is you. For a second there, I didn't even recognize you. It's been that long. Bruh, I play once a week. <laughs> you know, I was just thinking about you the other day, wondering what you were getting up to. I'm just glad to see you're still here in Dimwin. And I'm hyped to see what you do next. Aw, oh, they're so nice. You're, they're so nice. Do I, like, eat the games? I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't play any of, like, the retro games. My first console was a Wii, so, like, I didn't grow up playing with, like, 8-bit graphics, so, like, I don't have that nostalgia factor. So, my answer is the million-dollar question. Do I like 8-bit games? No. <laughs> huh? Megan? It's been, wow, ages. Fuck, everyone is saying they've missed me. Okay. Yeah, it's been ages since I saw you last. Were you away seeing a show or something? Even though your fave popster is right here on this island? I get it. It's totes important to see the world. Just don't forget to hang out with me sometimes, okay? <laughs> Feels bad, man. Okay, I promise I will play off stream. I promise, guys. Yeah, I agree. Because, like, my first anime that I ever watched was um, Oran High School Host Club. And I only watched the dub version. Mainly because, like, I liked the American, like, voice actor. Like, the voice for Haruhi had, like, a deeper voice, and I really liked it. <laughs> and it, I think also, when you first watch an anime that's dubbed, it's hard to, like, watch the sub version. Because you already have, like, an idea of what their voice sounds like in your head, right? Maybe that's why I like cats so much. I don't know. That is kind of wild. <laughs> that is all. <laughs> Dude, if I had a cat, I'd be so happy. But also, if I had a cat, I feel like they'd ruin my stuff. Because, like, my friend, he got a new gaming chair, right? And the moment he brought it in his bedroom, the cats, like, tore it up. And it's like, that sucks. 
feels bad, but also, like, they, I don't think they can really help it, right? You want a cat? Yeah. I know you said since you moved, you can't see your cat anymore. Just get a new one. Get a new one. Imagine you, like, working out so much that your whole personality, your whole house is just a gym. Not all cats are destructive. Yeah, that is true, that is true. <laughs> oh! You finally meet up? You're the whole reason I moved here, but I haven't seen you. So I thought maybe you left? I'm so pumped I finally ran into you. We're gonna get this whole island sweating. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're not ready yet, Sag. One day, one day, they will be ready. I also feel like a pet is just a big responsibility in general. Because if I have to like remind myself to brush my teeth every day. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I meant to laugh and then I snorted. Um I feel like I would have difficulty taking care of like a cat every day. Because when we did have the pet rabbit, my Oh my shovel broke. I'll have to buy a new one. Anyway, we had the pet rabbit. My job was to empty out the litter box and then clean the cage once a week. Not fun. Not fun. Because, um, looking back, I- Because, like, I know I have sensory issues, like, for sure. So, like, I don't like being dirty or, like, being sweaty. So, like, just the thought of, like, cleaning out the litter box. And when I had to clean the cage, um, we basically made him, like, a, a kennel. Not a kennel, a hutch is what you call it out of like plastic shelving and then because the plastic shelving it was like a fence basically so it had, it had holes in it so like we laid mini like rugs and carpets down so like sometimes the rabbit would miss the litter box so like there'd be like piss in the rug and just the thought of like touching the rug and like shaking it out like vacuuming all the fur out and then washing it like just the thought of touching it uh, the worst the worst like, i dreaded it Like, I wish my mom- like, now in the kitchen we have a, like, a box of disposable gloves. Like, the kind you can get at the dollar store. It's like, I'm fine with touching stuff now. But if I had that when I was little, that'd be amazing. Dude, my fishing rod broke too! Oh, they're talking to us. Let's talk to them. There's so much drama today. <laughs> what do you think about why you're walking around the island, Simon? If there are big, squishy clouds in the sky, sometimes I think about curling up in them for a nice nap. Or maybe biting them. Because they might taste like cotton candy. I'm not sure they'd be so comfy to sleep on, Snacky. Clouds are actually made of lots and lots of little water drops. Well, that's a real snooze kill. Why gotta ruin my dreams like that, Gale? Yeah, Gale! You bully! I'm sorry. I guess I just can't help wanting to share things I know. Okay, if that conversation was not an example of neurodivergence, then I don't know. Like, Gail just wanting to, like, share information that she, like, genuinely likes to learn and talk about weather and clouds. And then also Simon just, like, showing, like, pure excitement. And like Lee, like thinking about like his imaginative brain, and they just like shut each other down because like they can't read each other's social cues. If anybody's on the spectrum, I'm sure like you can relate to that to an extent. But, okay, I'm not properly diagnosed, but like I know I'm on the spectrum to an extent. Um, I literally know I am. Um, it, I, I've mentioned this before, but like there's so many members of my family that have uh, mental health issues. Like, different, different, like, severity levels, mind you. Um, but, oh, I was gonna buy tools. <laughs> My sister is properly diagnosed, and I was never diagnosed when I was younger because I was, like, more socially ahead than her. Um, but looking back, my parents should have gotten me evaluated as well. Um, because she was diagnosed with Asperger's, and I think I am, I think I have that too. Um, but like also it, it's weird to like think about getting like those tests or screenings when you're an adult 
Like, you ever see, like, the videos on, like, YouTube or TikTok and you're like, oh, I can totally relate to that. But it's also not good to self-diagnose, right? But it's like, I know something is not the right up here, you know? Uh, I feel it, man. I have depression and anxiety, but undiagnosed, so I know I got them. It's also, like, scary going to the doctor. Like, I know I said it early in stream. I don't want to share too much. I don't want to share too much. But, um, because the issue I have right now, it's five hours long and, <laughs> sorry, just the thought of having, like, someone with, like, ADD or ADHD, like, sitting down and taking a five-hour test. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like, why can't they make it shorter for you guys? Yeah, because, like, I agree. A lot of times, it's typically only diagnosed in children. Because my sister, the reason why she got evaluated and tested is because she didn't talk till she was four. So she was based- so her developmentally- she's two years behind everyone, basically. Like, she could- she, she's fully functioning, so like she can still like have a job and like talk to people. <laughs> but she definitely like struggles to like understand people. Like, oh my god. Looking back, this was kind of, like, really mean. But my parents, what they would do is if they said, like, an idiom or, like, an analogy and she didn't understand it, they would, like, write it on the fridge on a post-it note and then, like, not make fun of her, but, like, kind of, like, tease her a little bit about it. Looking at that, that's probably not the best approach. But, you know, parents are learning. You're not taught how to parent, so... Parents mess up sometimes, right? Yeah, I, I totally feel that. I think the last time I went to see a doctor was when I was like, what, fucking 10? And I'm 22, almost 23. So. We talked about this before, but chat, guys, I'll be real. If you don't have a PCP or a primary care physician or a primary care doctor, call and get one assigned to you and get that set up. That way, if anything ever does happen, or if you have a medical emergency, you can have an actual doctor assigned to you, that way you can get an appointment easier. Because I have mentioned this before, um, but I have been trying to get an appointment with my PCP since February, and I've only been able to get an appointment for next month in April because I didn't have my initial, like, client visit, meaning, um, because how it works, I assume it's pretty standard for the whole, like, country, for the states, is you have a doctor assigned to you, and then they do, like, a general exam for your first visit. And then from then on, you can just get, like, regular checkups whenever you want. Oh yeah, UTI suck. Thankfully, I've never had one. I had a close call. I had a close call one time. But, yeah. Like, for some stuff, you can, like, get over the chat, over the counter, right? But also some things you need to get, like, evaluated or diagnosed. And, like, I need to, um, get stuff looked at. <gasps> oh my god, it's this guy! Anyway, on a lighter note, let's go back to Animal Crossing. I love their house. It is so cute. And the little, like, school desks. Oh my god. The... Benjamin. Hi, it's me, Benjamin, from the day trip. You invited me to move here, and man, I'm glad I did. This place has the best bugs and tastiest fish. I just finished unpacking, so we can play whenever already. Oh my god, I want to talk to him more. They're actually so cute. I actually have, like, a school-type desk in my room, and I hate it. I don't like it. It's not as good. It's too big. My desk right here is really small, and I like it. It's not too bulky. Hey, <laughs> sorry about the mess, but I ain't got time to clean today. What are you doing, man? I'm making me a hyacinth crown. I forgot when you talk to them, they give you recipes. I forgot. Or DIYs, not recipes. <laughs> Imagine. One of the bugs on the floor whispered the DIY instructions in my ear while I was sleeping last night. So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. Check it out. Plans for a hyacinth crown. I can teach you if you want. Leave it to me. I got it all scribbled down right here. So just read this. I like their eyebrows. Like, they're so big and bushy. <laughs> if 
I can make it, then I bet you could do it in no time already. Yeah, I've thought about buying, like, yeah, like you said, like a big presidential desk, but I literally have no room. <laughs> If I had a big bedroom, then I would buy a giant desk. Because, like, my desk right now is just, like, a foldable fake wood one. Like, it's just in the corner. You, you can see, this is the corner of my room right here. Because, like, my bed is basically the whole room, almost. Like, the bedrooms in our house are super small. talk to everyone today? Because my goal was to at least talk to everyone. Yeah, I think we talked to everyone. Let's go. Okay, cool. Because I don't necessarily want to decorate yet. I kind of wait till I have more money. Oh yeah, I wanted to upgrade my storage. We need to see how much money we need for that. Okay, let's see if we can need to pay off our debt more now. I don't want to buy any rugs just yet. Like, I'd rather focus on saving money for, like, exterior decorations than stuff for the house. Nah, nothing new. <laughs> Let's see. Well, hello there! Your home is much roomier, yes? It's nice to have even a little extra space. Which brings us to... The cost of your remodel! That'll be 198,000 bells, okay? Ah, <laughs> yes. Please make your payments using the Nook Shots ABD feature, as you've done before. As always, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Okay, let's see if we have... I don't think we have any money in here. Oh my god, we're broke. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, at least we have more storage space now. So I think our focus is going to be... Probably just grinding money. So i.e. fishing, catching bugs. I think I'll do the off stream tomorrow as well. But we got about like 20 more minutes for Animal Crossing. So we can, we can fish a little bit. If we sent Antonio away... <laughs> then we could have like gone to like a deserted island but we made antonio stay the coin flip made antonio stay so we can do some fishing you know i know we talked about yesterday like adding sound alerts and then my take was i think they're distracting and annoying but if we had sound alerts enabled just for animal crossing that way you can like time them to mess up my fi to mess up my fishing then maybe that'd be good thoughts Honestly, fish in this game for hours and not be bored. Because it requires just the right amount of like concentration to keep you engaged. Because when you're fishing, you have to be like fully tuned into it. Like you can't be doing other stuff.
Why are you drinking? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what you're drinking to. Like, my fishing take is good? Or, I think, okay. I think it'd also be funny to spam Drake. Oh, drinking for funnies. Okay, okay, got it, boss. <laughs> uh, I am such an annoying chatter sometimes. Um, because my chat style, if you see me in, like, other streamers' chats, I'm usually, like, an emote spammer. Like, the chat... I think I typed the most in, in terms of big streamers, has got to be, like, Connor Eats Pants. But his chat, <laughs> they just be spamming capital D colon and then Drake all the time. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, like, I will be spamming Drake for, like, the weirdest things sometimes. Like, if you see me in Scootish's chat, like, anytime Scootish has, like, a decent take, I'll just be like, Drake. Oh, okay. Honestly? Honestly, I feel like I'm the one who made him enable Drake in the chat. I'm gonna be honest. I think it was me. I think I did it. Because I kept on typing Drake in the chat and he didn't have the um, BTTV emote enabled. Um, and he was like, what does Drake mean? I don't know what you're doing. Why do you keep, drag <laughs> Why do you keep typing Drake in the chat? And then like his chat explained like what Drake was. And then the next stream, Drake was enabled. So I feel like I did that. I feel like I elevated his stream. And by that, I mean like I'm the only one who spams Drake. But you know, it makes me happy. It makes me happy. <laughs> Talking about emotes, if you guys are new to chat and haven't already, I would extremely recommend you download these third-party extensions for desktop. Because you will see a whole new world of emotes. So take some time, download those, those extensions. <laughs> oh, look at Antonio. I don't like Antonio. No, I, Antonio's okay. He's nice. He's like the job character, but he's not too cocky. We scared that fish away. Okay, let's get some bugs. I've also heard some takes about how, like, Pepe emotes are bad, which I understand the take. Yes, there is some, like, not-so-good history with Pepe. But also, it's so integral to Twitch culture, in my opinion, to where it's, like, it's kind of hard to avoid it, right? But I just see emotes as, like, having fun. And I also think emotes are a good way for people who are, like, not necessarily, like, like, scared to chat. But it's definitely, it's a whole new, like, method of communicating, right? Because some people don't feel comfortable, like, saying hi all the time or, like, talking about themselves or, like, like, talking to the streamer directly. So, like, I think emotes is a good way to, like, kind of ease people into chat culture. Okay, Issa, you don't need to spam walls. <laughs> I mean, it's funny, it's funny, but just a single Drake is good. We get the message, homie. <laughs> okay, also, also, talking about emotes. There's some, like, streamers. Like, I'll, I'll browse the Discover tab sometimes. And they'll be like, no emote spam. And it's like, um, okay, dude. I can understand, like, people not wanting, like, walls of emotes. Like, I think that makes sense. Um. But also, like, to, I guess, dismiss the whole, like, subculture of emotes. To me, is making a mistake, right? <laughs> like, I think it was, uh, one of my friends who, like, watches this as well. Um, she said that, like, her she went into, like, a chat, right? Oh, we can't hear anything. Let it go. Just like we wanted to let Antonio go. Uh, anyway, so like she was in another chat and like she wasn't like typing typing, I think. Like she was just like typing emotes and like mods and like chatters were like berating her for it. Because like the emote spam was relevant to like the guy because like she was basically just spamming like type emotes and like they were like teasing her for it. And it's like, bruh, some people don't want to type in chat. They just want to spam emotes. Like just let them be. Okay? Okay. I think also, 
<laughs> I heard, okay. I heard, I think this will take from, like, I think Prezo's chat. But he, w he was, like, making fun of chat, saying, like, oh, everyone just spams Drake the whole time. And, like, it's so, like, and then, like, offhandedly, like, and, like, more sincerely, he said, like, people do it to, like, feel included. Because, um, like, if the chat spams one certain emote, you're gonna want to, like, tag along, right? Like, kind of follow, it's herd mentality. So, like, for example, if you see one person, and then two other people, and then, like, five other people start spamming, like, hearts or drakes, then you're gonna want to, like, copy that, right? Do you have lots of animals in the museum? Not really, not really. Um... It's also because I don't play as often as I could, so, like, I, I don't think I've gotten all the seasonly or monthly creatures yet, unfortunately. I'm gonna have to start playing off stream, I guess. I think in my previous save that I deleted, I had most every creature in the museum. I think I was missing like 10. So I had a decent amount. Yeah, Issa, I see that you're a rainy sub. Isn't that new WoW emote so good? Like, it's so good. I love it so much. Oh, I, I can't throw them. I was like, why isn't the fishing rod working? Like, I'm glad that I started the trend between my friends of making screenshot emotes. Because I think they are god tier. Also, they're just, like, a lot funnier and easier to, like, meme with, you know? Yeah, the, the Patrick Glam or the Raining Glam is so good. I think that emote is in her Discord server, too. So... I'll be, like, uh, messaging Rainy in our group chat, and she'll, just, she'll put, like, Rainy Glam after everything. <laughs> Even if it's, like, totally irrelevant, she'll just be like, Rainy Glam. <clears throat> Let's <clears throat> buy some more fishing rods. Yeah, because to me, if there's any like affiliates or partners that like have emotes. Like, make your emotes universal enough to where it's not, like, a niche thing, right? Like, have at least one emote be, like, funny on its own, right? Like, I can understand, like, having, like, inside jokes, but also, like, a new viewer will not understand those inside jokes, right? That's why, like, I think my most universal emote that I have is the punching one, the piece I 2 punch. Like, you can use that anywhere. Like, it doesn't necessarily like, show my face as much, too. Like, it's just me punching the air. So, like, that can be, like, used for anything. Yeah, the, the spin one is another good one. <laughs> I feel like the spin one would be fun to spam, like, if the screen apps or crashes. Just kind of, like, me freaking out, like, spitting in my chair. I think, um, because when I started streaming back in August, I didn't hit affiliate till January, and there's a reason why. Looking back, my content was not good. Not to say that my content is great now, but it's definitely better than it was six months ago. But, in the- oh, fuck! Sorry, I messed up, I messed up. I was too busy gloating. Anyway. So, like, in that six months, like, like, you spent- okay, if you're a streamer, and you don't watch other people's streams, what are you doing? That's called market research. Because there's like people who will like start streaming and not understand stream culture at all. Like that to me is wild. That's like becoming a YouTuber without watching YouTube. That makes no sense. Like if you want to stream, like watch streams and see what works. Like try and like figure out why you like a stream, why you like a specific streamer, right? Because 
there's obviously something they're doing right if you're wanting to watch them and like keep coming back to their streams, right? Anyway, so in that time, like, I saw like what works and what doesn't work, and also like saw what emotes people liked. As you can see, like, if because I think I have. I have three animated and then like six or seven channel emotes, I think. Let's see, let's see. I have, I have, oh, I have four animated. Two, four, six. Yeah, I have seven normal ones. And like, yeah, exactly. It's all about engaging with your viewers. Yeah, for sure. Like, is it earlier? The guy that I went into the Mario Kart stream and then they, he called me pissing. It's like, that was not a good impression, right? Let me preface. Everything I say is jokes, so if I say something like kind of rude, it's a joke. Okay, okay. <laughs> like how we were all goofing on Iso, it's all a joke. Okay, it's all a joke. Um, also, um, there's a lot of people who stream, and they don't sound excited. You know what I mean? Like the enthusiasm isn't there. Like I know I definitely put on like a shtick. Or like, I have an on voice. I talked about this earlier when I was on TikTok earlier. I go live on TikTok sometimes. Um, go follow, please. Um, anyway, I was talking about how you have like an on-screen personality, basically. Because streaming, you're broadcasting yourself. So essentially, you're broadcasting your normal personality. So if you don't change it or like tweak it a little bit for on-camera, then it's very hard to separate yourself from your stream, right? I think that's why a lot of people like fall off in terms of like fall out of their love for streaming. Because the reason why I like it so much is like I'll watch back clips or like portions of VODs and be like, look at Megan. That was a good joke. Or like she sounds so confident in that moment. And being able to separate yourself is very important. Oh, I scared the fish. Because I feel like a lot of my older streams are boring. They were boring as shit. Because one, I didn't talk much. I didn't, like, make an effort to, like, I guess, stay engaged. It's also hard when you don't have people watching. Because a lot of people, when they're first starting, they're still learning, i.e. me. Like, their commentary is basically, like, talking to chat. And if your chat isn't, like, popping off... Like, I know chat isn't popping off right now, and that's fine. But you have to, or the streamer, i.e. me, have to be able to, like, keep talking and, like, expand on what we're talking about, right? Because, for example, looking at Scott's previous message, it's all about engagement with the viewers. I can say, yeah, I agree. And, like, end it there. But see how I've expanded on that one message for, like, two, three minutes now. So. And it takes a long time to develop that, I guess, speaking skill. Like, I know I'm still learning. I'm not amazing. Like, I know I could be better. But... Just seeing how much I've changed in the past six months is crazy to me. Or, what? I've been sharing for eight months. Sag. I forgot it's March. Ba basically April at this point. Um... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, make a list. Exactly, exactly. Um... Because the reason why I started streaming was I wanted something to do and also, like, have an outlet. Because streaming at its core is a creative thing, right? Like, you shouldn't stream because you want to make money or you shouldn't stream because you want to be famous. You should stream because, like, you want to make good shit. I think that's why when I started doing the um, weekly Mario Kart challenges, that's when I started, one, seeing growth and also, like, enjoying streaming so much more. Because it gave me, like... Something weekly to look important, you know? Oh, I already talked to this guy. <laughs> Disappeared. What? Are you- The stream is still there, Issa. Like, are you good? Are you good? Did something happen? Um... Yeah. So, like, if anybody wants to start streaming... We're talking about the emote? Oh, Sag is still there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think that's just operator error, did it? Um... So if you want to start streaming, start for this right, right reasons. Yo, we're gonna ban me! <laughs> no, 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 no. 
no, no, no. We were goofing. We were goofing. Even though I have my, like, mouse on the band button at all times for everybody, we were goofing. It would take... Okay. Another thing you will see in small streams is you'll see, like, a lot of, like, weird people. I.e. people who are making, like, inappropriate messages or... Like, just saying weird things. Um, like, they'll let it slide. Like, I, for the most part, don't let shit slide. Like, because in my head, when I'm still small, when I'm still potentially growing... <laughs> poor Issa. <laughs> yeah, poor Issa. No, we're goofing. We're goofing on you. Um, what was I saying? So, since I'm still small, I'm still able to, like, shape my chat in a way that... Because once you, like, have a culture in chat, it's very hard to change it. Like... You know, if anybody watches, like, E-Rob, like, he's big. He's a big streamer. And, like, his whole chat just shits on him the whole time. And you know why that happens? Is because that culture was formed when he was still growing and still small. So, like, the old people in chat, the people who've been following for a long amount of time, that's what they're used to. And the new people coming in will see that it's okay to, like, shit on him, so they will do it as well. Like, hive my mentality, right? So that's why... Um, if a message or a joke is not okay, I will delete it. I won't- I- okay. I try not to call people out directly on stream, because, let's say for example, we have like a rando come in, and like they say some like weird offhanded shit, right? I would delete that quietly, because if it's like a first time chatter, or like their first day in chat, and they're saying well, like weird shit, you don't want to give them attention, right? Um, so like, if anybody's in chat and you see like something weird or like something like really bad, Ignore it. Do not engage with them because usually those people just want attention. Okay? Me and the mods will handle it. Um, because also you don't want people dogpiling on each other. Unless it's like fun. And like, okay, chatters, if any time like a joke I say you don't like, tell me. Like, just tell me and I will fix the problem. You know? Like, I will change my behavior. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, that's why like, I'm fine with, like, a little bit of goofing. A little bit of trolling is fine. But, um, I don't like when people, like, see me as an item. I don't think that is appropriate. Especially with a lot of, like, female streamers. There's so much, like, harassment already. And I don't condone that behavior. I don't want to be seen as an object. I don't want to be seen as a cute girl, even though, like, I'm cute, right? And... A lot of small streamers, they're scared about losing that one viewer or those two chatters that they'll let them stay. And it's like, no, I'm not dealing with that shit. Like, I don't care if I hurt your feelings, but you're hurting mine. So I have the right to censor you. That is my take. That is my take. So just be nice and you're welcome here. Yeah, exactly. They want attention. Which I know I want attention too sometimes. <laughs> um... I totally understand, like, that mentality, because I watched Twitch for, like, a year before I started streaming, right? So, like, I kind of understand the chatter mentality to where I want to say a joke or I want to say something that'll get a reaction, right? Because I know my chat's slow. That's fine. I like it. It feels more intimate, right? Like, it feels like I'm actually talking to people individually. But, like, if you're in a, in a stream where, like, you have, let's say, 100 viewers and their chat is really active, you're gonna want to say something that'll stand out, right? You're gonna want to say something that'll, like, egg him on. Right? Which is fine. As long as the joke is good, it's fine. But, like, if your joke is, like, sexist or racist or, like, outright hateful, well, dude, how about you don't? You know? Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah. Exactly. As I said earlier, like, browsing the Discover tab is wild sometimes. Um, because I've been a few, like, chats where, like, kind of like Eero, where they're just, like, rude to the streamer the whole time. And it's like, I don't want to vibe. That's not the vibe I want, you know? Because then it just feels like the chat is bullying the streamer. And it's like, I don't want that. It doesn't seem fun, you know? Like, I want to be a wholesome chatter who's, like, sometimes funny. Right? That, that's what I want to be. Okay, I'm going to put my stuff in storage and then call it a day here. How much money do I have? 67k. We, we're, we're up 20k today. Yeah, I think I'm gonna fish and, like, grind money off stream. I already know this DOI side. That way, when we come in next week, I'll have more money and then we can buy more decorations. 
I think that'd be pretty pogo. Um, that's basically my takes on, like, just streaming in general. Like, nothing too crazy. Oh my god. You see some wild takes about, like, small streamers sometimes. Like... Okay. Anyone pushing for affiliate right now? Um... When I was streaming, like, before I hit affiliate, it took me a long time. Which is fine, I expected it, right? Because I told my friends... Like, it's... It's, like, kind of like, you know... The unaccepted but normalized thing to, like, have your friends... Like, just have a tab open to, like, boost your numbers. But I don't like that. You know why? Because if your friend is, like, on their computer just with the tab open, they're not engaging. Yes, it is a number, but they're not, like, chatting. Typically. So it's like, they're not, to me, a real viewer. And that's not gonna help you. Like, one day they're gonna stop doing that, and then you're gonna fall off. <laughs> right? So, don't be too concerned about numbers. You know. Numbers are cool and all. But, I'd rather have people watching that genuinely like my commentary, or genuinely like the stream. And have people just have a tab open, you know? Um... <laughs> if Glamrock Freddy gets into Fortnite. <laughs> I think the Will Smith skin in Fortnite is pretty good. <clears throat> um... Talking about getting gifts from viewers. I don't- okay. I, I'm gonna be honest, I think it's weird, like, the whole concept of, like, donating money is, like, normalized, but also, like, weird, right? And I've thought, like, if I'm ever, like, a famous, right? If I ever have, like, a P.O. box, I think that's fine, but seeing people IRL is weird to me. Like, one, I don't want to dox myself, okay? And also... Even though, like, it feels like we're close in chat, or, like, you're close with your online friends, you don't, like, know them enough, you know? So, like, let's say, for example, if someone does a fan meetup, you should have security on staff with you. Or, like, with you, right? Um, <clears throat> like, for your own safety. Because you don't know. Like, if the address is publicized where you're gonna be, you don't- Like, yes, hopefully it'll be nice people. Oh, in Animal Crossing? I thought you meant IRL, bro. I was gonna go off on this whole tangent. <laughs> I, <laughs> I was like, Scott is sounding kind of sus right now. I need to fix my hair because this is pinching me. Anyway, to finish that IRL thing is... You don't know how there's like... Yeah, still do the tangent. Yes, I agree, Emmy. Um, There will always be people who cross that boundary, right? Either people DMing you inappropriate things or um, crossing that line, right? And I feel like meeting people at IRL is like definitely crossing a line. <laughs> it's fine, thank you, thank you, Scott. Let me let me end this tangent. <laughs> um, and it's like, yes, I appreciate people who come in a stream. Yes, I appreciate those who like sub, gift, etc. But there still needs to be that separation, right? Like, uh, for example, you know how Logan Paul, like, did an impromptu, like, not meetup, but it was, like, a scavenger hunt at VidCon one time? And, like, people got, like, trampled and shit. And it's like, if you're gonna do IRL stuff or, like, fan meetups, like, do them responsibly. Make sure nobody gets hurt, you know? Also for your own safety, too. You don't want to, like, dox your location. Yeah, exactly. Um, my policy on DMs, I'm fine with people DMing me, but, like... I'm not gonna promise that I'm gonna talk to you. Okay? Okay. Because I'm also just like super like introverted and nervous in general. So if you're gonna like DM me, like DM me for a purpose. Like that that sounds mean, but like it's like exhausting to talk to people sometimes. And I'm sure some people can relate to this, right? Um And also, like, I think... <laughs> yeah, I've been getting, like... Yeah, no problem, Tony. You were, like, asking a question, so you're fine. You're fine. 
Um, because I feel like DMing is like another step closer to feel like, oh, my streamer is my friend. And like, I don't want to like lead anyone on. Like not necessarily romantically, like platonically as well. Um, I think also like people put a lot of pressure or like a lot of streamers feel obligated to like talk to their viewers or their fans when there shouldn't really be that obligation, right? Because at, at, at its core, streamers are entertainers, right? The only- t I'm gonna save here and then we can switch to you Laffy Lose. Um, this is a little long ass tangent, but anyway. <laughs> because live streaming and like YouTube content is so different than traditional media. Because you can like talk and engage with your entertainer live. Like, it's so much different than TV, right? And, like, I feel like there's so many, like, parasocial relationships. And also, like, people... Like, the boundaries are blurry at times, right? And, like, I need to do my best to make sure... I protect myself. Like, I don't want to, like, disappoint anybody. But also, like, I need to protect my privacy, right? Um... Yeah. I think <laughs> that's all I want to, like, leave off on that tangent for now. I feel like we talk about this like every week but also we have more people coming in every week so I think it makes sense to like bring it up because not not only streamers try to talk about it and I'd rather talk about it now than like before I get to a point where like it becomes like an issue when there's more people here you know? I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Awkward. We can go ahead and Switch gears to a fan favorite segment of stream. Also, I'm um, talking about DMs. That is why I don't have. <sighs> um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, Usi, Chikusi. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 a good joke, but then it gets old. You know what I mean? Um, last thing I will say about DMs. There is a reason why I don't have a public Discord server yet. Because I feel like, one, I would not be able to moderate it as well as I could. But also, like, I don't want people to feel like they have direct access to me. Like, I don't- I'm not ready for that. You know what I mean? Okay, we are switching gears to my favorite part of stream. If I laugh, I end stream. Rules are fairly simple. Really simple. If I laugh, we end stream. <laughs> so stupid. Okay. <clears throat> it's YouTube time! Hey, what is that on screen? That's my YouTube channel! Everyone in chat should go subscribe. We are at... 119 subscribers! Oh my god, we're gonna beat PewDiePie. If you haven't already, go subscribe to the YouTube. New videos out sometimes. But, let's go ahead and get started. Oh, uh, um, ignore this, ignore this. Okay, rules are simple. If I laugh, I lose. If you guys in chat laugh, type 1 in chat and tell me what made you laugh. And then after this, we're gonna go ahead and thank subs. Okay, are you ready? Already got your giggles out? <laughs> PewDiePie who megalol. <laughs> Thank you, Emmy. <laughs> okay. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, also, gentle reminder. Um, exclamation, you laugh, you lose. will link you to the Google form to where you chatters can su submit videos to make me laugh. You have a month to do it. Okay, let's go, let's go. <clears throat>
That was cute. Resistance. Did they drive Ready? through the gate? Idiot, you didn't throw it hard enough. <laughs> okay, you guys didn't hear it. I don't think you heard it. But I definitely, like, he laughed, so I lost. I lost Sedge. Careful my TV, though. Oh, man. Right. That's a bitch. clumsy as fuck, for real. <laughs> crabs in there. Hey buddy, yeah. Do you skate? Yeah, I do. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> yeah, I couldn't give the last two minutes. True. <laughs> She's come such a long way, but I do know that you are a good person and that I am a good person. <laughs> Is that like self-affirmations when like, you know, you did something wrong. So you pull up that AVI file and you play that to make yourself feel better. Turn it off, turn it off. Wait, give him more. Give him more. That's gonna kill somebody. Oh my god! Dude, I thought he was gonna put his face right by the pipe. Wow. Pour me one cup of water. Day two, we're trying to break this light bulb. TikTok is so fucking stupid. You ever see the videos where it's like, ooh, I'm gonna dance every day until this celebrity notices me? It's fucking stupid. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, wow, true. Fantastic. Insects. Just that watch what they can do. That was mean. Oh, no. <laughs> Allah, Sister has become a hijabi on this day. So good. <laughs> I bought it. Oh, cool.
chicken right there? Chicken's up. Let me show around first. Hey, you're like wedging between the two lines. I'm gonna let you in, but do not climb up that curtain. <laughs> Oi, I said do not climb up the <laughs> Oh my god, they're still alone. Oh, dude, that was cool. Oh my god, look at that. Trampoline. Oh my god, that's somebody's trampoline. Oh, I thought it was gonna like hit them. Oh, I was like, what the fuck is that sound? I was like, are there bones? Are there bones breaking? I <laughs> Yeah, I messed up. I I know. <laughs> I don't I don't get that last one. That was cute. I like how they're adding like little animals at the end. Oh, that's cute, that's cute. Okay, cool, that was fun. Anybody laugh? We got Issa, Issa laugh. Anybody else? Anybody else? Yeah. If you haven't already, go sub. Please. <laughs> okay. We can go ahead and oops, wrong one. We can switch ears to thanking subs. Yay! <laughs> I feel like I'm so I I did not realize how loud I talk. Because when I stream for a game audio, I only have one earbud in. Because I swear my right ear is Deeper than my left one. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the phone cam set up. Um, that way we can think subs. Okay, we're turning on do not disturb mode. That way I don't dox anyone. <clears throat> Anybody new to chat at end of stream? We think subs by writing their name in a journal. There is also a channel point redemption. So you can drop. Um, 750 channel points and I'll write your name as well. I don't think you're loud. It, it's just like weird taking off the headsets and seeing how like, how much louder I'm talking, I guess. <laughs> I, I said this before. But the, the time I stream, I would stream later in the day. But the issue with that is that more people are home, i.e. they see I talk too loud and that I'm annoying. Or more annoying than normal, mind you. So I usually stream when everyone's at work. And there was one time where my sister came home from work early, so she got home at like 1.30. And she was like, Megan, you talk really fucking loud. And I was like, I know. <laughs> because my mic, you know how you can't see it on screen? It's about um a foot away from me. Because I don't like seeing it on camera. I don't like having stuff in my face. Um, So like, I have to talk a bit louder for it to pick me up. Okay, we are setting up the camera right now. I have to change my tripod because I did a TikTok live earlier. If you aren't already, go follow my TikTok. I post funny haha clips from stream. And I copium, I promise I'm going to start doing more art streams there as well. <clears throat> but I did one this morning and it did... Oh, fuck, I almost turned off my phone. I mean, frick. Um, like on the TikTok live earlier, I just did calligraphy, so I just wrote people's names and stuff. So nothing too crazy. There we go. We got it set up. Okay. Oh. Phone cam, activate. Also, if you want your name written right now, you can either sub gift bits or. Redeem the channel point redemption. Um, yesterday we filled up this page. Now we can start a new one. Okay, so earlier in stream, we had the Scootish, the partnered streamer Scootish, come into my chat who Megalo Megan and gift this stuff. <laughs> Okay, so Scootish, their username is a nice blue. Let's give them this dark navy. 
<laughs> also like a nice chill way to end stream. I think S's are so hard to draw in this style without doing like a cursive S. I should put some music on, huh? <laughs> Let's put Animal Crossing back on. There we go. That way it's not as... A quiet. That way the silence isn't as loud, you know? <laughs> I messed up the tea. I like lifted it up. You can't really see it, but like, I lifted it up. The line isn't straight. Sag. There we go. And we got Scootish, who gifted a tier one sub. Let's go. Let's do like a light blue accent. And I kind of wanted to like add stuff like this. Oh, I messed up there. Like just like a little bit of border instead of the flowers. But I feel like these are kind of like action lines. Like almost like bubble-ish style. I think that looks cool. See, like, I didn't put a full outline, but see how it's like broken. I think that looks cool. Thoughts? Okay, then we also had Emmy Beef come into stream and resubscribe. Her username is like this nice hot pink. <clears throat> did I play any other Animal Crossing games before Horizon? No, I did not. Unfortunately, I did not. I wish I did, but I think because. I didn't like get into gaming. Like, oh, the music stopped. It's like, it's the Animal Crossing loading screen. So, like, the music like stops for like 10 seconds and then it starts again. So, that's why it stopped. It's on the loading screen right now. Uh, anyway, I didn't like get into gaming until like after high school. So, like, I wish I played some of the older games. Unfortunately, I didn't. I'll have to replay them. Not replay them. I'll have to play them at some point. But, like, I just don't have the nostalgia factor, you know? I wish you could hear, like, the sound of the pen. Because when you press down, it kind of makes a squeaking noise. Really satisfying. Like, almost ASMR like. Probably would be good. Probably like a light pink accent would be nice. I need you. So, do <laughs> Zoom in so we can see the accent lines a little bit better. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Like just adding like those little lines give it a bit more like action, I guess. I'm in art school, so I know some things, but not a lot, you know. Okay, so yeah, we had Scootish and then Emmy Beef. <laughs> um, yeah. So that how did that does it? That how. I was gonna say that about about does it, but that makes literally no sense. Um, but that does it for today's stream. 
Um, I'm gonna see if any of my friends are alive right now. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Fuck, Cutie Leaf said she was gonna go live today. I was gonna read out to the Cutie Leaf, but she's not fucking live. Imagine. Imagine. I'm gonna go yell at her. <laughs> I'm kidding, I am kidding. Um, yeah, so, as I always say, like, we only read out to people we know, and nobody I know is live, Sag. Um, yeah, anyway, anyway, bye, Scott. Um, thank you to anybody who came in the stream today. I know today was, like, popping off a little bit, so I'm glad people liked- I feel like- I feel like I clickbaited a little bit too hard with the Mario Kart. I feel like saying I'm fucking pro. I feel like I clickbaited- But, you know, maybe it worked, maybe it worked. <laughs> um, anyway, anyway. Um, I will be live again tomorrow, same time, 11 a.m. PST with more SM3D World. And if you want to see some of my offline stuff, you can check out my other social media accounts. I have a Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. Please, please, go follow the TikTok. Did I spell it wrong? I, <laughs> I'm not going to say it. I spelled it funny, kind. Go follow the TikTok. I post daily clips and occasional streams. I did a TikTok live today where I just wrote people's names and I thought that was fun. So if you can't sub, then go follow the TikTok and maybe watch TikTok Live and I might write your name. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but it's fun because like TikTok Lives are totally different than Twitch streams. It's it's wildly different. Oh, okay, I'm not gonna leave you guys. I definitely like Tik or Twitch Lives more because like the TikTok Live UI is not fully there. Um, but follow that, please. On the road to 10K, guys. <laughs> um. Anyway, enough cell promo. Um, seriously, thank you to anybody who came on the stream. It, it's, it feels good to have regulars, you know. It feels good. You know, makes it, we talked about it earlier, but like, it, it's nice to hear and see that people like the stream, like the content. When I'm, I'm just like a normal person, you know. It, it's, it's crazy to me. So yeah. Yeah, imagine Keely like, playing a real game. That won't break her PC. Um, but yeah. Uh, honestly, thank you everyone. Today was good. Today was fun. I'm going to end stream, eat lunch, and fucking take a nap. <laughs> okay, I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye.